Welcome to the Shifter's Den, everybody. This is Jay the Shifter speaking, and today we are starting a playthrough of uh, Tokyo After School Summoners, also known as Osamo. Uh, I assume that if you guys are here to watch this playthrough, you know what this game is about. Otherwise, here's a short description I have found on tvtropes.org. I will link the page in the description below. Tokyo After School Summoners, also known as Osamo, is a mobile game developed by Life Wonders. Defined as a card battle RPG, the game is targeted towards LGBT individuals, with 95% of the game's cast being gay. The player can choose from up to 5 appearances for his or, or their main character, select cards and companions, choose selections in a story, and battle foes in a grid-based RPG system. So, without further ado, let's uh, tap to start and jump in. We are going to go with language setting English, okay. Play this game, you must agree to the terms of use. Yes, I have read those ahead of time. So now, we are in the character creator. We have many choices actually for our character. We have this uh, younger looking one. We have, uh, well, this more ladylike one. We have this bigger one. He's quite handsome, isn't he? We got this one, who is more of a, I guess, vision and protagonist type. And we have this one, who is, uh, well, a bit more of an overweight choice for uh, those that enjoy these characters. Uh, on my side, I am planning on taking this character, he is the one that is most of my, of my tastes. So that is what we are going to go for. Select this appearance. We have five choices regarding the voice we are going to give to our protagonist. So let's have a little listen to voice one. Sounds a little too young for my tastes. Hmm, little too feminine. Makasero. Ooh. Mai <laughs> makasero. Maybe a little too masculine. Yosh, koko desu. Ah! Sumimasen. Ato wa tanomimasu. This one sounds like it could be nice. Tsukisho. Tsukisho. Yup. Yare, yare. Ooh. Kuraina. Yare, yare. Okay, I think we are going to go with voice for select voice. Our gender identity is going to be men. And name wise, we are going to go with shifter. Okay. Confirm. Ikimasu. Transfer form, as defined in the Refugee and Immigration Control Act, Chapter 2, Section 3, the Ministry of Justice, Immigration, Bureau, recognizes the following transfer student. Shifter, man, with a picture. Cute. Confirm. Let's see where this brings us. I've been looking forward to properly starting up this game. Chapter 1. The Mysterious Trenchant Student. Encounter. Have you ever had anyone you could truly call a friend? That question in the back of your mind forces your scattered thoughts to focus. The world you see before you is pitch black. It's a world completely void of everything. You can't remember anything, not a single thing at all. 
Not your knowledge, your experiences, or your memories. You can't even remember the ones you love most. <sighs> Suddenly, you hear someone calling out to you. You don't know who the voice belongs to. Perhaps it isn't even a voice. But it guides you through the darkness, and you follow, only because you have nothing else to grasp onto. Soon, the darkness begins to fade from your vision. This world has called you here. Now open your eyes, there is no need to be afraid. This is the beginning of a story. The story of your true self and even truer friends. On that day, a blinding flash of light pierces the sky above Tokyo. When the light fades, you find yourself in a forest you don't recognize. The entire area is dark, not a person in sight. The only light is a soft glow illuminating the trees. There is no one around to help you make sense of this. You have no idea what's going on. Hmm. You realize that you're holding something. It's your phone. You can tell it's yours from the way it feels in your hand. Where exactly are you and what are you doing here? There's no use panicking. First, try and get your bearings. So we have three options. Check a signboard to see where you are, check your phone to see your location, try to remember who you are. Mm, let's check our phone, shall we? It seems that you are in Shinjuku Central Park in Tokyo. Mm, what am I doing here? I was playing on my phone and then... And then what? My memory is all easy. What am I doing here? <laughs> Have you finally noticed me? There's no reason to be afraid. Do you think someone with a voice this charming will hurt you? Come on, take a look at your phone. The app's already running. The cheerful voice feels strangely out of place in the otherwise quiet forest. You start to feel worried. Very, very worried. Your gut tells you no good will come of this. But more importantly, you need info. You need someone to talk to. You unlock your phone, and as soon as you do, a hexagram appears with a bright flash. Ta-da! Wow, <laughs> does it feel good to be out of there? Master, how can I be of service? There must be something. Your wish is my command. Ah. What the heck are you? A monster came out of my phone. Oh, oh cute! Oh shucks, me cute. <laughs> Thanks, master. Hmm. Why are you staring at me like that? Ah, uh, I know, you got no idea what's going on. Don't worry, I get you. It's a lot of crazy stuff to take in. But leave it to me, I'm a level 3 butler. So I know what I'm doing. Uh, <clears throat> Allow me to introduce myself. I'm your familiar and in-game assistant, Salomon. Just tell the ever adorable Lil Salomon whatever your heart desires. Huh. Lil Salomon. Hey, you Salomon thing. Oh, that's rude. Huh. Lil Salomon? Yes. What is it, master? Master, game, what am I doing here? Can I pet you? Pet me? If that's your wish, master. Please be gentle, I've never been petted before. Pet, 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 pet. Ah, well, there goes my first time. Did you like it, master? I hope you take responsibility and become an outstanding master. 
Jeez, don't play dumb. When I say master, I mean master. You were invited by the app, so maybe someone summoned you? Hmm, wait. Huh? I don't see the summoner anywhere. I wonder if they went off to pick flowers or something. Anyway, next topic. Master, do you know what summoning is? Hmm, you mean like what they do in fantasy stories? Just got to the chase already. Hmm. You mean like what they do in fantasy stories? Yeah, that's right. You sure know your stuff, master. I love manga and anime. They're such a unique part of human culture. But I digress. Let me get back on track. Alternate worlds, lands, dimensions. They are identical but distinct. Parallel worlds born from infinite possibilities. For example, in another world, you might have been born as something other than human. But this, you can never meet the you from other worlds. Tao, you're the same existence, your worlds are separate. But there is one way. Through the awesome power of summoning, you can connect to the you that exists in an alternate world. Summoning connects worlds through gates. It identifies the ties that bind souls and manifests them. And the ones who wield that power are called summoners. Yes, drumroll please. That means you're a summoner, master. Uh, me? A summoner? Sounds fishy to me. This must all be a dream. Huh, me? A summoner? That's right, master. Isn't it exciting? You're like the protagonist of a grand adventure. What? You have no idea? But the proof is right there on your phone. Take a look at the home screen. Master, you downloaded the app and registered as a user, didn't you? That app is a handy tool that helps the many summoners connect with one another. Normally, you need both innate talent and rigorous training to become a summoner. But with this app, none of that is necessary. I'm sure a summoner somewhere called you here, as they're familiar. Does what I've explained so far make sense? Someone just called me here? That's selfish. Yep, uh-huh, whatever. Aw, you're so cute, little Salomon. Oh jeez, master, you flatter me. Anyway, as a summoner, you'll be able to harness amazing power. <gasps> uh, why so quiet all of a sudden? If you've gotta go, the bathroom is that way. Hmm. If you've gotta go, the bathroom is that way. That's not it! This presence is abnormal. It feels like it was summoned. It's speeding toward us. Please protect me, master. Get away! Stay back! What did I do to deserve this? Ah. Oh, what did I bump into? Oh. S sorry I don't know who you are, but are you okay? Human. Human. Flesh. <laughs> We've got better stuff to worry about right now. Let's get out of here. Um, m more monsters? Why are there monsters in the middle of Tokyo? This way. We shall be safe once we get through here. Oh no, it's under construction. It wasn't like this yesterday. Uh, okay, let's try this way. Follow me. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Eight. Flash. Uh, there's nowhere else to run. I was just trying to take a shortcut to the station. Why did I have to run into a stray sentient? Transient, actually. I knew I should have listened to the class rep and not gone to the gate side. Ah. Stay back. If you're not a transient yourself, you don't stand a chance against one. 
Rawr. Oh no, it's coming right for us. Had I known this is how it will end, I would have eaten those snacks I hid under my bed. Uh, uh, Alright, bring it. I'll take you on. Get behind me. If you're going to eat one of us, eat him. Oh, rude. Get behind me. Uh, huh? <sighs> you get in the way? Then eat you first. <laughs> Brrrr. Uh, we'd better split up, if even one of us can make it out alive. Uh, uh, oh no, it's coming for me. Now's your chance, make a run for it. Looks like we're in a pickle, master. Huh? Why am I so calm? Not to worry, master. Ta-da! <sighs> I just accelerated subjective perception and... Well, let's just say I stopped time. <laughs> Ain't I great? I may be a rookie, but I'm still a demon. This is no sweat. Well, unfortunately, you can't move either. For now, just calm down and listen to what I'm about to tell you. Master, it's time to fight. Take a good look at the enemy one more time. Hmm. It looks super strong. It looks tasty, if you know what I mean. Mm. <laughs> now that you mention it, that outfit is a bit alluring. I wonder what's going on under that cloth. <laughs> Let's see... Uh, what? <laughs> oh my! A anyway, please take this a bit more seriously, master. Look at that club and those thick arms. It certainly is a pretty scary looking fella. Yep, it sure looks tough. I'm shaking in my hooves. But not to worry. You've got a way to fight back, master. Uh, fight back? Forget that, let's get out of here. Or the time has come to unleash my secret power. Oh, oh, what? You have hidden powers? Wait, you don't? Do you? This is a matter of life and death. Please focus. Well, I figured I had some kind of secret power if I'm here. Master, you were summoned by someone as their familiar. And since you can use the hub, you can also become a summoner yourself. That's right, you can be someone's familiar and also call your own familiars. In other words, you're a hybrid. Uh, got it, let's try it out. But I don't know who or what to summon. I want to summon something sexy. You don't need to summon something like that, you've got me after all. <laughs> I knew something like this will happen, so I used the app's auto-match function for you. Here's a strong entity with a profound bond with your soul. Summon them to gain their aid. <laughs> Aren't I a great butler? Now let's do that summon. Rawr! Uh? Rawr! What the? No one else should be able to move right now. I did everything according to the familiar textbook I have here. Oh, looks like I messed up the order. Whoops, I'm such a klutz. Rawr. <laughs> Master, save me! Get off me! Hurry up and do the summoning! Rawr. Over here, you straight transient, you? That human look tasty, but this human look tastier. I uh, guess it's really gonna come after me. If I make it out of this alive, maybe I should go on a diet. Guts, flesh, but tasty. It's now.
<laughs> Now's our chance, master. Let's get out of here while it's distracted. Uh, we're running away? We're not gonna help him? What about the summoning? You can save yourself if you make a run for it while the red honey is eating that guy. Come on, I'll teach you how to summon later. Uh, I suppose that's one way to look at it. But he came back for us. I hate hoeing other people. But he came back for us. B but I can't allow you to put yourself in danger, master. Besides, that fat guy is a total stranger. You just met him. There's no reason for you to help, but if you won't take no for an answer, then you're either too nice or you're planning on using him for something. You say that, but... I only just met you too, little Solomon. <laughs> he looks more trustworthy than you. Ouch. I only just met you too, little Solomon. <laughs> Master, I can't believe you'd say that. These tears won't stop. You're breaking my heart. Ah! Don't sound like things are going well for the big guy. Come, Master. We need to go before the monster comes back. Master? Master! Please, wait! Stop! We're not giving up on anybody. Ah. Ah. Mine no. Mine no. All that candy I just bought. I won't be able to eat it. <laughs> this way. Hurry. Y you saved me. But what are we gonna do now? We'll defeat that monster. What to do indeed. You're a lot plumper up close. Ouch. We'll defeat that monster. Defeat it? But how? Huh? You want to know why I came back for you? Well, I was super scared and I was almost eaten alive. But if I just ran away, I wouldn't be able to live with myself. I'd remember that I abandoned you for the rest of my life. I wouldn't be able to enjoy a good meal anymore. Isn't that also why you came back to save me? I... Rawr. It cough up to us. Rawr. Yeah. Mm. The monster's blow knocks both of you back. Your lungs gaps for hair. It hurts just to breathe. Mm. Must eat, fat human. No escape. The red honey mumbles to itself as it plucks the boy up. It looks down as if it knows it has won. Uh, he's not a friend, nor is he family. He's just a stranger whose name you don't even know. You should have no problem abandoning him. There's no reason to risk your life. Uh. But you know his voice, you've looked into his eyes, you've spoken with him. And now, you can't forsake him. He has already become a part of your world. <laughs> Stop! Huh? Oh, master, you're too soft. Softer than a baby's bottom. If it weren't for me, you would have handed up a bloody pulp. Thank you. You came back for me? I'll pet you later. Y you tempt me so, <laughs> if you insist. Master, I respect your decision and I don't want you to die either. I'm a bit nervous about how this will go down, but let's defeat that thing right now. Rawr. There's no time, master. It's do or die. Begin the summoning. Repeat these words after me. With voice recognition, the app will do the rest. Um, 
Roll of the Wanderer, Rule of Rending. Now you. Roll of the Wanderer, Roll of the Wanderer. <laughs> rule of Rending, Rule of Rending. Here we go. Forge reification. Thou who heart nameless in this world and powerless to claim this world. Deceive the world, hinder the world, and by thy false name manifest in this closed domain. Avatar of the serpent's tail, severed by the wanderer, bear thy rule of rending and cleave all power and authority. Engrave my name unto thee and come forth, boundless tail. Go ahead, master. Uh, engrave my name unto thee. Uh, uh, what? Uh, sword? With this, I can fight. What? This power? Summon? Can't be. Are you? Summoner? What? I look for you always since I come to world. You unseal me from Kumano Shrine. I challenge you to fight. I win. I eat you. You win. Just who are you? This is where the fun begins, master. Other monsters are being drawn to the power of your immense summoning, but I know you can do it. I'm rooting for you, master. You've got this. Give him! Eck! So, uh, don't die. Got it? Sure, I'm gonna do my best not to die. Let's do this. <laughs> Attack in battle by moving to a square in your territory that sits in front of an enemy. You can move one square in any direction. Master, try moving by dragging your unique one square to the right, directly in front of your opponent, on the marker. Okay. So we slide here, attack this guy, 109, and we get that. Two more enemies have appeared. Slash type enemies can attack enemies in front of them, as well as forward diagonals. All at once. Move one square left and try defeating two enemies at once. Let's try over here. There we go. Master, you possess a passive skill that can randomly trigger and bestow crit status status, which boosts your attack power. All skills activate by random chance, but I've made sure it will definitely work just this once. Move to the left and attack. Now have at! Let's go. 220. That's our skill activated. Nice. Now take some time to try moving around from square to square. Thanks to his trust attributes, the enemy boss can attack from afar. And if their skill activates, they can in also inflict the poison status effect to deal damage each turn. Please be careful, master. Okay, let's Ikimasu. move here. Do this. Enemy turn. Ouch. We got poisoned. Okay, so by clicking on our portrait, we can see our information. Current status. Poison. Level 1. Remaining turns. Or deal fix the mage every turn. Alright. Seems like our skill at level 1 is Dragonborn. When attacking, bestow crit on self at 20% chance, I assume. And our charge skill, Boundless Tail. Deal slash the mage to target plus remove single debuff on self. Ooh, that sounds fun. Alright. Well, let's do this. So I guess I stay in the same area. Do a crit just like this. And we... We won! We did it! Perfect! This was our first summoning and we did it! 
we got I assume this is money these stars I'm not quite sure and we got the honey I guess we are now at a uh, uh, thousand three hundred coin obtain bonus for initial completion of this quest ooh the thousand coins Now's your chance. Get him, master! Roll of the Wanderer. Rule of Rending. Engrave my name unto thee. Rrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
Oh, sorry. I could thank you first. Thanks for saving my butt. I'm Ryota. Ryota Yakushimaru. I'm a student at Shinjuku Academy. Right smack in the middle between Shinjuku Central Park and Shinjuku Station. What's your name? I am Shifter. So you're a Shifter. That's a nice name. Let's head someplace safer for now. It's kinda dangerous here. Come on, follow me. And there we go. That wasn't too bad for our first one, was it? You obtained a random Oni card. Open the card and touch the team upgrade button at the bottom of the right of the screen to add it to your team. View the teams you have formed for quests. Upgrade cards using items and view character card details. Select edit team. Oh, oh, oh. <clears throat> Hello. This... This guy is kinda cute, isn't he? What's this? Hello. Aww. Tap the blank square 2 from the left to place the red honey in the second position of your team. Okay. Select the red honey card you obtained earlier. A red honey card has been placed in your team. Try using the item you got earlier to level up the card. Use the back button on the top left of the screen to go back one screen. Okay. So, Try using the item obtained earlier to level the card up. Select level up. The red honey. Use items or coins to level up your character cards. Touch one of the following. Click to select item. So right here. Oh, we can do a XP auto select. By tapping the comfort button below, the selected items will be used to upgrade the card. The confirm and try it out. So it put oh these things are upgrade materials. Tap to select up to 20 upgrade items at once. Select your newly gained upgrade items and touch the OK button at the top left of the screen. I see. Level up confirm. And poof! Good! Status being upgraded! Now our red Oni is level 2. Gained a bunch of health and a bunch of attack. Almost doubled his attack. No, more than doubled his attack actually. Your card has been leveled up. Return to the map screen and proceed to the new quest in Shinjuku Ward. You can return to the previous screen by selecting back in the top left of the screen. Okay. I'm... Oh, that's a cute face. He seems to be impressed. I don't understand what he says, though. I'm sorry, y'all. If I ever figure it out, I will make sure to put up some subtitles. Tap Shinjuku Ward on the map to move on to the next quest. Summoner's Guide. Well... For now, this is going to be the end of this first video. In the next video, in the next part, we are going to go forth with the main quest, Summoner's Guide. Until then, thank you everybody for coming and hanging out over here. I hope you had a good time with my narration and uh, do like and subscribe if you enjoyed what you've seen. In any cases, Goodbye everybody, have a good one.